If visible light can't be used to view nano-sized features, what can? In part one, we learned that nanostructures are much smaller than the wavelength of visible light. In order to view smaller particles, something with a shorter wavelength is required. As it turns out, all matter has wavelengths, and they're pretty damn short. These are known as matter waves. A cool bro named de Broglie hypothesized a relationship relating wavelength and momentum, stating the faster and or heavier an object is, the shorter its wavelength. We can easily accelerate electrons fast enough to decrease their wavelength to a size that makes imaging nanostructures possible. A high-speed electron beam is used in place of light in the majority of nanoscale imaging. This is the basis of electron microscopy. In the following videos, we'll discuss the scanning and transmission electron microscopes. Here are links to the Seeing Nano series, the Nanobytes series, and all of the videos on this channel.